was nothing special about it. Just the typical snatch and grab. The money was good too. But the second I got there, something was off. The building had three escape routes, two alarm systems, and at that hour, only one guard per floor. It was almost too simple. I disabled the first alarm with ease. Then I was in. The ground floor guard was eyeing the room like a hawk, but it wouldn't help him. I swept past him unseen and made my way to the inner alarm system. I had disabled better alarms in my sleep, but wouldn't you believe it? I used all the right tools and all the top techniques. And just as the alarm was about dead for good, the damn thing glitches. And then it got worse. I finally killed the alarm. And I found out that the door to the room was suddenly locked. They must have upgraded to the electronic padlock's door overnight. It was a total fluke. Any normal person in this situation would have to call it quits. But not me. <laughs> you better believe I picked that lock faster than you can say dead bolt. And then headed straight to the main display room. There were a lot of valuables in that joint. But as an expert thief, you have to keep your eyes on the prize. Little did I know, the diamond would be protected by a laser system that my employer never bothered to mention. The lasers were no match for my cat-like reflexes. But there was one more obstacle between me and the priceless gem. All of a sudden, the guard got the power on me. Probably trying to spook me into giving away my location. After the lights came back on, all I had to do was grab the diamond and get out. The staircase would take me to the roof and from there, I could easily base jump to safety. But it was set up. They must have known I was going to rob the place. They had eight officers waiting to pounce on me. There was nothing I could do. So what are you in for?